What's up everyone, this is Ben and today I'm going to be showing you guys how you can get any font on any Android device that supports an app called iFont which is available for free from the Google Play Store. And I'll jump straight into this video. So first you'll have to go to the Play Store and search for an app called iFont. It should be the first tab that pops up in the search results so simply install that. When you're done you can open it up. This app is really well organized which I really like. On the left you have little side menu, in here you can go to settings where, where you can change the font size, check the font space, switch the online font, enable group mode, check on or off the auto reboot option which will automatically reboot the phone after you apply a new font and finally you can adjust the download server. You can also donate to developers, check the FAQ and look at some details about the app. You also have 4 different ways for selecting your fonts, you can just go online and browse the fonts, you can browse your phone, you can install a font from the iPhone folder and finally you have an option to add a custom font. You can also search for fonts by their name which is really nice. And on the right side you have another settings button and you have the option to share and promote the iPhone tab. So to install and apply the font to your device, simply find the font that you like. You can then preview the different sizes of it and see what it looks like and then you can either download it or support the creator or the font. So let's just click on the download button. After the download is finished, simply click set and your phone will restart. After your phone reboots, you should be able to have a custom font on your Android device which is really nice. Also if you get tired of a custom font, you can always change to a different one or just switch to a different one, just go to the local section and restore to the factory font which will then give you the option to back up your current font. Anyway guys that's pretty much it for this quick little tutorial and iPhone app review. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did then make sure to smack that like button below as it really does help me out. Also comment down below with the name of your favorite font and finally be sure to subscribe for more high quality Android content.